welcome back to it's Halloween time and we're watching lots of movies. We gotta work on that. Welcome back to my channel. If you have not been here before, if this is your very first visit, hi, welcome, subscribe, stick around. We, we're gonna have fun. So for the month of October, to celebrate Halloween, I am putting out one movie a week and for the fourth week, I thought it would be really fun to allow you all to choose a scary movie for me to watch and react to and commentate for all of you and your enjoyment. I'm not regretting this decision at all, so don't forget to vote down below in the pinned comment what scary movie you want me to watch. It's gonna be great. But before we get to that point in our Halloween adventure, we're just watching easy stuff. And today we're watching Halloween Town, which is a Disney classic that everyone has seen. I'm sure I've seen it. I don't know if I've seen it. After Hocus Pocus, I was like trying to extract just one memory, one scene, you know, just scrummaging around in my 50 years of memories up here and just like, I just need one scene of Halloween Town just to pull it out of my memory. At one point, I thought I had one, but turns out it was just some random Mary-Kate and Ashley movie that apparently lives in my head rent-free. So, have I seen this? I apparently don't know. I'm too old to know anything anymore. But we've got the latte, we've got the Reese cups, and let's go. Let's get right into it. Is this scary too? Are all Halloween movies scary? Why can't I just have a fun time? It was more like it. It's just one night. What is the big deal? Um, it does seem a little unfair. I mean, seeing as how Marnie likes weird stuff so much. Skeletons, witches, vampires. You know, she spends our whole math class drawing ghosts in her notebook. Guys! Marnie's got an obsession. Marnie will see you all tomorrow. <gasps> Mom! See you later. Mom! Why does the mom hate Halloween? <laughs> is she me? Oh my god, me as a mom. Well, I think it's obvious why Halloween is bad, but then all that candy causes cavities and gum disease and those masks everybody wears of these weird kind of toxic fumes inside that make your arms go limp and... and... That's it. It's enough. I don't need to hear any more. You've got me. I mean, how are we supposed to grow up if we can't explore the world, try new stuff, and take some risks? Yeah, like trick-or-treating. Why are you so obsessed with Halloween? Personally, give me a good nature documentary any day. This kid is my best friend. Come on. Suit yourself. I'm gonna guess. Are they witches? Is the mama witch? Give me all the witch content. Just witches though. Nothing else. Witches. And, and pumpkins. I really want that cookie. Think about it. Manifest it. Oh, I was kidding. I didn't know Matilda's shit was about to go down. Ken. Are you eating a cookie? Oh. The kid doesn't know, but the mom knows. It's opposite of Matilda. Okay, wait. I want a Reese cup. I want a Reese cup. How come you've been gone so long, Grandma? Well, you know one thing and another. You know, just witch stuff. Does this grandma only show up on Halloween? Bring skeletons and candy. And no one is like, mm, the robe thing you wear. It just gives off witch vibes, you know? Every time you come into this house, it's, it's chaos and the candy and the decorations and the... You mean it's fun, you prude? Put on your honor. Don't tell them about home. Oh, don't worry, dear. I won't tell them a thing. I feel like she's gonna tell them a thing. Just came by to uh, check that everyone's got their thermostat set to 68 degrees because it's important to conserve energy during the evening hours yeah. and- 68 degrees. Hey Siri, what is 68 degrees Fahrenheit in Celsius? 68 degrees Fahrenheit is 20 degrees Celsius. No. 20, like at least 22 for overnight, I think, is fine. 
But let's not freeze ourselves to death. There, Halloween Town. Let me see. This girl is way too overexcited about all things Halloween. Oh, look, and there's a werewolf and a vampire and a gnome. Gnomes, though, we're not a fan of gnomes. Witches, we love you. Thank you for being you. Gnomes? There's nothing special about me. Oh, no, no, dear, you're very special. You're a Cromwell. And since the dawn of time, the Cromwells have been Mother. the most powerful. She asked nicely, to be fair. She asked nicely, please don't tell them. That grandma just crossed a little boundary. And after I specifically told you not to tell them anything about it, I was only trying to do what you should have done long ago. You not your decision. I'm kind of on the mom's side here. I know I'm not supposed to be. I'm supposed to be on the grandma's side, but I'm a little bit on the mom's side. And if I decide not to train her like a witch, then it's none of your business. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, fine. Bury your head in the sand of that precious mortal world of yours. Peasant mortal. Marnie's decided. She's decided. She's going and she's gonna fight the force. She is a witch and so is mom and so am I because they both said so. What do you think? I think you went to the wrong I think it sibling. Insanity is hereditary. I yeah. just hope boys are immune. Yeah. You didn't go to the right sibling. Go to the other one. The other one, I'll have your back. And now that I found out the truth, I'm not gonna stay here and turn all boring and human like you. Okay, ow. Get going. Come? I don't know, but I'm not missing it. What? Put on the magic school bus. Help me, baby. I'm a wah, wah, wah. It must be, um, you know, one of those charter buses coming back from a costume party at the Moose Lodge. Dude, you're flying. You're in the clouds. Here. Yeah, where's here? Halloween Town. You gotta keep up, guy. Whoa, I don't get it. Monsters are just pretend. Dylan, this is it. Mom's Dylan. Just pretend. We need you to catch up. You gotta be here with us. We've got to find them. What are you doing? We're gonna lose. <gasps> so. F Hello there. I don't believe we've met. And that means I'm in trouble because the mayor's supposed to know everybody. I'm Sophie. Pardon? Sophie. What? Sophie. I seem to have a. a... Oh, fuck off. This is the perfect chance for me to try my powers. Powers? What powers? Well, I don't know. I haven't tried them yet. <clears throat> I believe in you, Marnie. Abracadabra. A little basic. Try again. Open sesame? Hmm. It's still pretty basic. You're doing great. Big iron lock that keeps us out. Open up your big iron mouth. That was a bit better. A little less basic, but shit, Marnie. She's gonna open it. She's like, I want the lock open. I want the lock. Sophie, how did you do that? She I pushed. Knows. I wish the lock would turn into a frog. Why? How did you get here? <laughs> On the bus. <laughs> I came to start my training, Grandma. Your train? Oh, it was you outside the kitchen. I thought I heard someone listening. Oh, Grandma, you knew. And you're just like, I'm just gonna casually mention some powers and things. 13th Halloween's grandma. This is witch's brew. It's a little recipe that I picked up in the 6th century. I want a cauldron. I should just replace all of my kitchenware with like little different sized cauldrons. You see, spells are much more powerful when more than one witch joins in, especially if they're Cromwells. Are the Cromwells like champions of the witches or something? They're really getting worked up. That sucks. The people who started your Halloween just imitating our traditions. Mortals see, mortals do. I feel attacked. Sorry, I'm just a mortal. Oh, it's closed. <laughs> Excuse you, Harriet. That was terrifying. I think you've uncovered something very serious. What is it? What's wrong? I want you to leave this alone for now. Oh, he's evil. He's in it. He's part of it. He's evil. I don't trust him anymore. He pulls candy from his ear. He's trying to suck up 
to the newbies. Nope, I don't trust you, Mr. Mayor. I think we're gonna need to vote you out of office and vote Grandma in. But this is a local boy, Luke. Hey, don't sell me too short there, Grammy. I'm something of a big cheese around here. Maybe I can show you around sometime. Maybe Buy not. You know, I was kind of hungry, but then I smelled something stinky. It must have been the big cheese. Yeah. You almost had it. You almost had it. But it's okay, Marnie. We can work on your insults. <laughs> what a witch's life it is. <laughs> yeah. Grandma, that's me now. Do that. Do that. I don't think so. <laughs> Shit. I'm kind of glad she's here, but also, like, kind of party pooper. Grandma needs help. And since you won't help her, she needs the only other Cromwell witch there is, me. You are not a witch. <laughs> oh, just ugh, dagger in the heart. Say goodbye to Grandma, everybody. It's time for us to go home. Thanks, Grandma. It was a great ride. Did you really expect a hug? She's clearly pissed at you. Well, what do you know? The puss isn't running. I guess we can't leave after all. Yay! What time is it? There must be someone. You can't even tell. Wait, the mayor seems like a nice guy. Maybe he can tell. No, 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 no. We don't trust the mayor. We don't trust the mayor. Are you not keeping up? Keep up. You're the mayor? Oh, they used to bang? <laughs> Just... <laughs> Anytime someone's nice to someone in a movie, I'm like, oh, they used to do it. Go away, Luke. I'm not in the movie. Yeah, literally. Fuck hey, off, Luke. Luke. Fighting this thing all alone, no one believing you? What do you know about that? I know you've got Merlin's talisman. He wants it. Who is he? Okay, Luke. You got some info? Give it up. Look, if you want to give up your roots, that's fine. But I don't. And that's not right for you to try to make me. I don't know whose side I'm on. I mean, she's only 13. So, like, you can't really make decisions for yourself when you're that young, my dude. But on the other hand, if this is her last year and you're taking away a piece of her life that she doesn't have the option to discuss, then I think I am on the 13-year-old side. Oh, God. Being a parent must be absolutely terrible. I'm going to be bad at it. I don't like that. Harriet? Oh, damn, Harriet. Looking rough. <laughs> I just got goosebumps. Sir, could you not? As soon your hold over the creatures of Halloween Town will be broken forever. Do you think your magic is more powerful than mine? I'm really scared right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, as if that could happen. What the hell are you doing there, Luke? Creature hasn't been born that's quick enough to catch a Cromwell. <laughs> Mother? Grandma? Get them! The mom's gotta come in clutch here, right? Like, mom, if you're a witch. The benighted hours be the vanquished by my power. <laughs> Powers, not flowers. Yeah, you're a little rusty, though, I think. Uh, keep trying, though. It's okay. I will be your master. Oh. That guy's the mayor, right? It's gotta be. He's that guy. That's what he had to go do. He's like, I gotta go take care of some shit. Turning people into stone. Don't be all right. Go. Here, go, it's Marnie. Just... Oh, yeah. Marnie's gonna get to save the day. She's gonna go train herself, become a witch, Jedi, and she's gonna save the day. Or maybe the little girl is. Maybe this is Sophie's time to shine. <laughs> I wouldn't hate that. Getting the talisman lit is our only chance of saving mom and grandma. Here, I copied the ingredients from grandma's cookbook. Hair of a werewolf, sweat of a ghost. Come on, Dylan. We're Cromwells. You don't know what that means yet. <laughs> I don't know what that means yet. Are they like the Kardashians of the witch clan? I don't know this yet as a viewer, but I'm supposed to somehow believe it because they just keep saying their last name. Like there's some kind of celebrity, 
but I don't know what it is yet. Don't touch that, okay? No, don't worry, I use one of these don't all the put time, that down. okay? Put the thing down. I got it, I got it, I got the it. The other button, sweetheart. Put the thing down, baby. Oh! <laughs> that was a big chunk of hair. I personally would have went for some scissors, you know, just a little snippy snip. He did him dirty, like. This looks like a bad remake of Cats. Don't hurt me, doctor. I'm not very good with pain. Oh, you won't feel a thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that would suck as a vampire. Half your fang gone? I think you just wouldn't feel whole anymore. There she is. Come on. I got it! I got it! Can we trust skeleton guy? I don't know. He's a shitty driver. And the mayor, like, calls on him for favors and stuff. I'm skeptical. Vampire fang, ghost sweat, werewolf hair a la mode. Good job. Like, good job, team. You really came together and got those ingredients that you needed. I'm proud. Betty March, Betty Gunther, Betty uh, Guggenheim is all that's bid. There's gotta be a spell book. Go looking. Betty Ma, Betty Gefeer, Betty Gein, Betty Sweetum, North Bid. You know, Grandma says that spells are stronger when you have more than one witch. You wanna help me? Okay. Okay. Let's do this. Grandma says that spells are simple. That, that you just have to want it and then let yourself have it. Sophie's been literally trying to tell you guys that all along. Cookie, want it, it comes, you know? Gate, want it, open, it comes. Frog, there was a frog involved. It's just, you guys need to pay attention to the young ones. Guys, it's lit. I did it. We did it. We're witches. You can celebrate later. Come on, let's get out of here. She's really patting herself on the back. She's like, I deserve this cloak now. It's the bad thing. It worked, you dumb thing. It worked. What do you think's gonna happen here? Grandma said something about installing it. What? Installing it? Installing it where? Oh man, she looks like she fell off the Titanic. Do you remember what Grandma said about our traditions being an imitation of theirs? Well, when it's dark on Halloween, where do you put the candle? Okay, come through. Out of my way, Luke. Look, about what happened earlier, I didn't know you was gonna do that to your mom and Grandma. Save your tricks, twerp. <laughs> It's the mayor. It's right on City Hall. They're, they're throwing the hints. Too long have we been exiled to this second class world! Second? I mean, I kind of think your world's pretty great, to be honest. I think you're just being a little greedy. <laughs> oh, I'm so happy I figured this out. Oh, young Cromwell, you thought you could hide from me? It's gonna be Luke. Stop. Give me the talisman. There, you disobey me. Is it Luke? Did he sacrifice himself? Redemption, you get it. You get redemption. Still kind of bad what you did, but you do get redemption. Uh, 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 Sophie. Sophie, we need you. Oh, come on, Marn. He got her and it's not working. We've lost. We. Ow. Yeah, we don't need a downer right now. We don't need you with that attitude. Believe. Is it going to break? <laughs> It's working! Oh, you just needed to smash it this whole time. <laughs> You're protecting it too much. I mean, 
mean, it's kind of great. Like, good job, Marnie. But she just, she didn't do that on purpose. Like, she just accidentally passed out and dropped it. Couldn't they have made her the real hero? Like, she figured it out. She figured out what to do. She smashed it in front of him, and it was, like, really amazing. She did it. This is like, oh, you just happened to kind of pass out, drop it, break it. You're the hero. But not on purpose. <laughs> I feel bad. I wanted her to have a moment. Do not underestimate me, Agatha. Ah. <laughs> okay, here we go. Round two. Marnie, I feel like you get a moment here. <laughs> Oh, grandma's gonna come through, which is great. <sighs> I just feel like Marnie's being robbed of her moment, you know? No way! I don't have any powers. I'm the normal one in this family. I mean, no. <laughs> Not even without the powers. You weren't. <laughs> That was so anticlimactic. Couldn't he like blow up? Like into flames. I'd a coven here, my dear. <laughs> oh, I thought they were a handful before. <laughs> hey, it wasn't me. That stuff coming out of my fingertips is probably just static electricity. Or maybe that Aurora Borealis thing I was reading about. No, my dear, that's in the sky. Who is that? What about Luke? How did Luke turn into a monster? Luke? Oh. Hi. I mean, you kind of deserve it. I guess it wasn't much of a reason for being all evil and all, huh? Especially since even when I was good looking, I didn't have a chance of getting a date with you. A date? You don't have to make a love interest at the end of every movie. They could have just been friends. That would have been fun and dandy. I was thinking I could use a babysitter on Thursday nights. You know my PTA meetings sometimes they go on forever. Oh dear, you know that I can't cross over only on Halloween night. Well, then I guess you're just gonna have to come live with us. <gasps> that is, if you want to. But how does that work? Gonna come live with us? Does she lose oh, her powers? So cool. okay, I can can you, you just go live in the mortal world? On video, and then you can show me how to Marnie, oh, I have questions. I, I need you to chill for a minute. On your mind. Mind. Want for step? God, man, she's so sweet. So glad she faked sleeping and made it on this journey with us. <laughs> Bye, Magic School Bus. Bye, Miss Frizzle. I do have many questions about her living in the mortal world. Maybe that's for another day. Alrighty, Halloween Town. Can confirm. I have not seen that movie before. <laughs> Nothing came back to me. How did I go my entire childhood not seeing Halloween Town? My sister talked about this movie all the time and I just was like, yeah, I've seen it. I'm just a liar, I guess. <laughs> I think what's happening is like, I feel like Halloween Town is a memory I should have if I was a normal child. And so I just, I just took it on. I just, just decided, yeah, I've seen this. I haven't. But it is a really sweet movie. A couple, like, I mean, I really do wish Marnie got her moment. I think that's the only thing I would change is like, don't make it be like accidental. That kind of sucks. That kind of took away from it. But what a really cute movie. Couple scary parts, <laughs> but we made it through. I, I like this Halloween movie. I feel like this is a really nice, light, airy, fluffy Halloween movie. You know what I mean by that? Maybe not. <laughs> Come back for the next movie. One more movie before I watch the scary movie. Please like this video, subscribe, comment down below anything, but most importantly, what scary movie you want me to watch and uh, what else? Oh yeah, if you look at my boobies. <laughs> so sorry there's pumpkins on my boobies and this shirt is from my own little etsy shop that i just started so the link to that will also be down below if you want pumpkins on your boobies or 
other things on your boobies or other things that aren't on your boobies. There's so much to choose from. <laughs> so go check that out. Link will be down below. The Halloween collection is still up. We'll be up for the rest of October. And then I'll be launching the winter, Christmas, holiday kind of stuff. So um, yeah, check that out. Okay, that's gonna be it for today. We'll wrap it up. I love you all. Thank you for hanging out with me. Get out of here. <laughs>